Hey everybody, Jeremy here with another Windows tip this time around. This is a follow-up on my previous video where I exported drivers from a running Windows 10 or 11 system. This time around, and to follow up on a question that was asked on whether there is a way to restore those drivers, and yes, yes there is. So let's go ahead and do that. The utility we want to use is pnputil. We want to say slash add driver. And then in quotes, the full path to where your drivers were exported to. Backslash star.inf. Close your quotes. You want to do slash subders, so it'll search in any subdirectories that exist. You want to install, and if necessary, reboot the computer. Now, this is the same computer I did the export on, so all the drivers are here. This is not going to reboot, but we'll run through the process just the same. And as you can see, it goes through and it says adding driver package it gives you the name of the driver driver package added successfully already exists in the system and what the published name is and this saves me from having to hunt down the proper drivers if i can just export them and save them over to a thumb drive or onto the network so i hope you found this useful if you like the video please give a thumbs up if you're not already subscribed, please do so as well. And if you have the desire to support the channel in a larger way, feel free to check out the link in the description for buy me a coffee and you can feel free to uh, give a donation over there. And that would all be greatly appreciated. I try to put all the money back into equipment and services that I need to keep everything up and running. And so the support I've got so far has been uh, very helpful in achieving that. And on that note, thank you once again for watching. Stay safe out there and have a great day.